Hello, my beautiful Tauruses. How are you guys today? The reading that I will be doing for today will be messages from your angels, reflective of the months April through June. Um, this beautiful deck is by Doreen Virtue. Okay. Um, I just wanted to address one thing before I get started, and that is actually about a comment that I had received from one viewer indicating that I shuffle too much <laughs> during my readings. And I just wanted to address that that is my style of how I do my readings. Um, I rely heavily on jumped cards, cards that just fly out as I'm shuffling. Um, it also helps me to focus and stay grounded while I'm concentrating on doing a reading for your particular sign. So if the excessive shuffling uh, bothers you in any way, or if it annoys you, um, you know, please feel free to find another channel or reader that's more closely uh, matching to the type of reading that you would prefer. Okay? And it will not offend me in any way. I totally understand. Um, I'm not everyone's cup of tea as far as a reader. So, um, yeah, totally your choice. All right. So moving forward for my Tauruses, let's see what messages we receive from your angels, guys. All right. Angel Francesca has really been very prominent in all my readings so far. So let's see if she comes through again. All right. And if she does, you'll totally understand. She's a really great card to come through. All right, so my Tauruses, angels, what messages do you have for my Tauruses for the months of April through June of this year? Okay, your first angel, Tauruses, is Shanti. Angel Shanti. Okay. And she will be reflective of your present situation. Okay. Your immediate future is represented by Angel Daniel. Okay. We'll find out more about Angel Daniel in a moment. Let's see if I could pull one more card. For my Tauruses, Angel Desiree. And she will be reflective of your three month um, reading. Okay, so bottom of the deck is Angel Bridget. All right, so Tauruses, let's take a look here. So in the present position, we've got Angel Shanti, beautiful card right there. And her card says, I am the Angel of Peace. I bring you new tranquility and a smoother road ahead. So this is telling me that for some of you Tauruses, you've kind of had a rough road leading up to this present moment. You guys have been having a bit of a rough time um, in your life, very stressful, um, just weighing you down. Whatever issues you've been dealing with, it's been very hard on you. But Angel Shanti is basically letting you know, because she is the angel of peace, you're coming into a new level of tranquility in your life, a new level of tranquility and a smoother road ahead. So it's not going to be as rough as it has been. Perhaps it could have been financial. Perhaps some of you guys might have lost a job or um, broke up with someone, something devastating for some of you that broke your heart. So Angel Shanti is basically telling you you're about to come into some peace in your heart to where it's going to be a little bit easier to breathe, a little bit easier to get up in the morning and not be so stressed out, a, li a little bit easier for you to just go to sleep and get some much needed rest physically, emotionally, spiritually. So you're headed in that direction. So just breathe and know that things are going to get better. 
Okay, so in the immediate future, we have Angel Daniel. All right, Tauruses. And Angel Daniel represents um, marriage. He is the angel of marriage. And it says, I am the angel of marriage and I am assisting you right now. Now, this is telling me that some of you Tauruses have marriages that are falling apart. Some are strained. Some are really not working out and are on the brink of divorce. Um, don't be afraid to call to Angel Daniel if, in fact, you do want to work things out. And also to make things a little bit more amicable if, indeed, you are ending a marriage. He is here to assist you at this very moment. So don't be afraid to call upon him for assistance, for guidance, for comfort. He's here for you. It's certainly a very difficult time when a marriage is starting to crumble. And if there are issues here, if there are third parties involved, if money is an issue, children, um, whatever the case may be, there are tensions in a marriage for some of you Tauruses that need to be addressed. And Angel Daniel can certainly help ease the road to working things out a little bit better. So don't be afraid to pray about it and definitely use Angel Daniel as a means of figuring out a way to move forward where it's amicable for everyone, everyone involved, especially if there are children in the mix. Okay, and uh, for your three months ahead, guys, we've got Angel Desiree. And Angel Desiree, her card says, no conditions... Let me read that again. It says, no, conditions aren't favorable right now. Wait or look into other options and ask the angels to help guide and comfort you. So for some of you, you're considering something like an option and it's just not the right time. You have to wait, you have to have patience because there's something better in store for you. Okay, Tauruses, and um, you just need to be able to kind of silence your mind in order to make the best decision for you, but you can't rush it. You just have to wait until con conditions improve and whatever issue you're on the fence about in order to make a better informed decision for you in the future. And finally, bottom of the deck, we have Angel Bridget and her card says caution is warranted. Look deeper into this situation before proceeding further. And boy, does that pick up off of Angel Desiree's message. Okay, so there are issues that you're dealing with, Tauruses, that probably are not as favorable for you. And so you need to kind of weigh your options um, to see if there's something better out there for you. And, um, just take your time making a decision instead of hastily acting upon an opportunity that may end up not being the best for you. Okay, Tauruses, so um, that's your reading for April through June. If this reading resonates with you, please give me a like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.